And TV's Melita Oletengez tells us more. The busy roadworks will not only improve the Kiawara Bellevue Road, but the excavators unearthed a rather interesting find. 51-year-old archaeologist and farmer Richard Kinyoa discovered what he says are tools with striking similarity with tools used by the Homo erectus over one million years ago. They include Achillean hand axes, which could have been used by the early man to cut tree branches, stone hammers for crushing, and flakes that could have been used in skinning animals. <laughs> The discovery changes the narrative on the early man. The discovery could mean that the early man may have lived in the highlands and not just in the Rift Valley. Last year, a similar discovery was made around the Ngong Hills on the outskirts of Nairobi. Kinyo says he has more than 50 stone artifacts he claims to have collected in Gatarakwa in the past four months. Kinyo has also mapped out the findings which extend to the Ngamilili Hill. Upade huu ni waku, ni waku kata. Upade huu ni waku shika. Labda ikuwa inatumika kukata misisi ama kukata nyama abayo haina mifupa. The former University of Nairobi student says he has been conducting research for the past 20 years in different parts of the country including Turkana and Magadi. He says his main challenges include finances and preservation of the archaeological sites. In the past, most scientific research on the study of mankind has been based in the Rift Valley, where most archaeological sites are set up. But the discovery of such tools by one Richard Kinyoa brings in a different perspective. Could this be a change in the archived history or a new frontier in the discovery of the early man's life? Milita, Oletenges, NTV, in Gatarakwa, Nyeri County.